Hello Pisces, welcome to your next 48 to 72 hours of reading. So Pisces, these messages are general, they will not resonate with everyone. Take what does, leave the rest out. Also, this is timeless, so whenever you click on this video, that's when the messages could resonate the most. So let's go ahead and get you some energy. Spirit, give me some messages for Pisces, please. Energy for Pisces, what's going on? Okay. I have relax, clear your mind. <laughs> Give me another message, please, for Pisces. And then I have, ooh, signs and symbolisms. Watch out for the signs from the universe. All right. So um, for some of you, I'm just getting like sit still. I feel like you could be just getting a lot of um, synchronicities from God, from source here. For some of you, you could be seeing a lot of numbers, 222, 333, 555, 1010, 1111, 111. Yeah, somebody's seeing just a whole bunch of numbers, just like the frequency of it. I heard every day here, you see numbers. So let's go ahead and tap in a little bit more. Spirit, tell me more about relax please energy for relax for pisces yeah just sit still here pisces that's what i'm getting you need to sit still um for some of you um i'm hearing like meditate you may want to do some meditation i'm also hearing practical for some of you um i feel like you're being led to make more um, practical and sound decisions when it comes to your life. Give me another energy for relax. Why is relax here for Pisces? I have a three of swords. So for some of you, you could have recently um, went through a betrayal. Or you're going to be finding out about a betrayal. For some of you, this could be a third party situation. The king of swords at the bottom of the deck. So you could be deciding to cut someone off here. Yes, close out a cycle with this person. Give me another energy on relax. It's like, do not, um, I heard overwhelmed. Somebody could be feeling overwhelmed here. I have the Ace of Swords. So yes, for some of you, the truth about a third party situation, about a betrayal here, is going to be coming out in the next 48 to 72 hours. My left eye just jumped. So that is the truth for someone. Give me an energy on the Three of Swords. I have the Five of Wands. So listen, this is going to create a lot of, um, um, drama conflict for some of you i'm also getting you could have a lot of people like competing for you um who or who's in competition with you here or in competition with somebody you want to be with yeah you could be having a third party or this could be um the other energy that you're attached to give me another message for the three of swords why is the three of swords here for pisces oh i have the king of wands in the reverse all right, so for some of you, somebody's not taking any action here. I feel like um, this person is just letting things happen. Um, they're relaxed. Yeah, somebody's just not giving in here. Somebody kind of has their back turned towards the drama. Somebody's not doing anything about what's going on around them. I'm hearing like let it flow. Yeah, somebody's just allowing. Um, somebody could be a little bit too um, calm about something. Turning their back to the situation. Have their eyes closed. Somebody's avoiding here. That's what I'm getting. A heavy avoiding energy. Give me some messages for the Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Look at this, the Queen of Swords. The truth is out. I feel like for some of you, this could be um, an air sign feminine here that's going to reveal the truth, but truth is now here. Give me another energy on the Ace of Swords. Why is the Ace of Swords here? A lot of swords, so heavy on the air and fire. Um, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Leo, Aries, Sagittarius. Give me another energy on the Ace of Swords, please, for the air signs. So I have the Devil and the Queen of Pentacles. So somebody could be very toxic here, low vibrational. Somebody could be dealing with a Capricorn. This could be somebody's spouse here, somebody's wife. Let's clarify further. Spirit, tell me more about the Five of Wands. Why is the Five of Wands here? 
for Pisces, please. <laughs> Look at this, the Seven of Swords. So somebody is very like, I heard evil. <laughs> Somebody is like plotting here. Somebody's very deceptive. Like somebody's always trying to get away with something. Somebody's trying to create a distraction for you. So either this is for you or for your person, but somebody's trying to create a distraction here. With this seven of swords, clarify the five of wands. Give me another energy on this king of wands in the reverse, the star in the reverse. Aquarius energy. Give me another energy on this King of Wands. Somebody is no longer attracted to somebody. Somebody no longer views someone in the same light. I even heard disgusted. Like somebody uh, is just repulsed by somebody else. Like they they don't desire this person anymore. Yeah, the Knight of Swords in the reverse. So listen, somebody's not taking any action here. Yeah. Somebody no longer wants to deal with another energy. Give me um, an energy on this star. Why is the star in the reverse? For Pisces. Why is the star in the reverse for Pisces? Oh, on the cards, Phil. Okay, give me an energy on the star for Pisces. The Emperor. Aries energy. For some of you, um, there's a lot of competition for this emperor here. Somebody um, of a very high status, caliber. Somebody could be in leadership, have their own business here. Um... Give me another energy on the star. I'm getting degrade. So somebody could think like very negative about women here. Could degrade women. Give me another energy on the star. Why is the star here? Somebody doesn't um view women in a very positive light. Somebody could have mommy issues. The sun. I'm getting lost. Somebody could have um be finding out about a, a lost pregnancy here. My condolences. I've been picking up that heavy lately. Somebody's reputation um, is being ruined here or has been ruined. Somebody's been knocked down a couple of notches. We have Leo heavy on a fire. Give me some energy on the sun. Why is the sun here? Justice, Libra energy, heavy on the major arcana. So something's being balanced out when it comes to a situation. Give me another energy on the sun. This is the cups. This has something to do with the past. So there's some type of exposure is coming out about the past here. Something somebody has done in the past. Like this is justice being served. Like this is somebody's karma here. Yeah, for an action that they took in the past. Somebody's under judgment. I heard scrutiny. Somebody could be under like public scrutiny here. Give me some energy on this Queen of Swords. Why is this Queen of Swords here? You know what? Give me something on the Six of Cups. What is this action that um, happened? What happened in the past for Pisces? Okay. 
Wow, look, I have judgment in the reverse. Something was um, an injustice. Something wasn't fair. It wasn't right. Give me another energy on the Six of Cups. Yeah, the Two of Wands. So somebody could have tried to like block someone's path here. Tried to stop someone from moving forward. Yeah, the Six of Wands at the bottom of the deck. Yeah, trying to block someone's success or um somebody's reputation try to ruin someone's reputation how they're viewed in the public the public eye here but yeah something definitely was an injustice when it came to someone else and light is being shed on this give me another energy on this two of wands why is the two of wands here for pisces I have the Knight of Pentacles, but it came out sideways. Somebody tried to like dig up information here. And like with this Knight of Wands sideways, I'm just getting like continuously. Like if they didn't find anything, they will still go back and try to dig up information. Yeah, somebody literally tried to stop someone's forward movement. For some of you, this person could have tried to use the justice system to bring forth evidence but something didn't go as planned but yeah somebody tried to research you and look up information or you could have did this to someone but it's like this person really didn't find anything because it's like they kept having to go back but somebody did try to delay you or you tried to delay someone or this could be somebody around you here pisces give me an energy for the queen of swords yeah something was like a betrayal here a major betrayal that's coming to light and it's like with this relaxed clear mind i feel like whoever this person is who um was in on this betrayal for some of you i'm hearing a group of people it's like they never thought they would get caught they never thought this information like would come to light they never thought they would be under judgment and have to pay for their past actions here give me an energy for the queen of swords why is the queen of swords here Yeah, somebody tried to research someone to kind of like expose them, ruin their reputation, expose them in the public eye. Yeah, somebody could have a channel here, could be online. Clarifying the Queen of Swords is the High Priestess. Somebody's the truth. Somebody's the truth. Somebody tells the truth. Somebody could be very intuitive here. Yeah. Give me another um, energy on this Queen of Swords, please. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Oh, the Five of Cups in the reverse. So Nine of Swords at the bottom. So somebody's stressing out about this truth coming out. Somebody's a seer here, though. Yeah, somebody's definitely a high priestess. Pisces, this is your energy. So this could definitely be you or somebody else um, with Pisces highly aspected. Give me an energy on the Five of Cups. Why is the Five of Cups here in the reverse? Clarifying the Queen of Swords. The Queen of Cups. Somebody's highly intuitive. Highly for some of you, like, this is somebody who really doesn't, um, I mean, they, like, reminisce over the past. Like, this is somebody who doesn't allow the past to stop them. They they know how to let go. They're forgiving. Yes, this is a very forgiving energy here. A very compassionate and loving energy. Somebody's very wise. Yeah, highly intuitive. Somebody's also a messenger. Yeah, give me an energy for the devil. Why is the devil here? The seven of pentacles and the three of pentacles. Yeah, somebody was waiting for something to happen, but it never did. They could have worked with a group of people here. Somebody wanted your spot. Somebody wanted to be in the limelight. Somebody like wanted to be you. Somebody could have wanted to copy you here. Yeah, but somebody thought like by doing something, it was going to put them in your spot or in this person's spot. Like somebody wanted to pretty much covet, take somebody's life here or somebody's lifestyle. Give me an energy on 
this three of pentacles why is the three of pentacles here Why is the three of pentacles here for pisces the king of swords so um we have the king and queen of swords a couple out here I'm hearing something about divorced. So for some of you, you could be divorced from this person or getting a divorce. But yeah, I feel like um, someone worked together here with somebody that they were partnered up with in a relationship with, married to, with a group of people. It's like it was a, I heard a team effort. I heard somebody tried to to get themselves to look like someone else. Give me um another energy for the three of pentacles. The hang one Pisces. This is your energy. Somebody wanted um people to believe that they were <laughs> this person, and I. I don't mean to laugh, but somebody like went to the extremes here. Like somebody could have changed their appearance, even their skin tone or trying to. Maybe somebody tried to tan, but somebody went to the extremes. They really tried to get like this King of Swords energy get, gives, it's giving me believe. They try to make people believe that they were actually this person. Like somebody like completely like lost themselves. Like they started to believe they were this person. <laughs> yes, like that's all they wanted people to see. But it's like it didn't work. Like people were just looking like what? Give me an energy. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Give me an energy on the Seven of Pentacles. Why is the Seven of Pentacles here for Pisces? Why is the Seven of <laughs> Why is the Seven of Pentacles here for Pisces? The Seven of Pentacles for Pisces, please. <laughs> oh, the Ace of Cups. Yeah. For some of you, like, this person did this for, like, a relationship, a, a offer here, yeah. Somebody just wanted, but some of you, the way this Queen of Cups and this, this, the way this Ace of Cups is on top of this Queen of Cups and this High Priestess, this person wanted your gifts. For some of you, this person tried to take your gifts here. They wanted your gifts. Like whatever God gave to you, whatever overflows here. Because the five of cups also represents the senses. The five, the ace of cups, I'm sorry. The five senses. So it's like somebody wanted your gifts. Somebody wanted what you have. When it comes to your spiritual abilities, your inclinations. Um, somebody wanted what you were born with. What your natural born talents here. They wanted your blessings. And somebody thought like they could get this, you know, easily. You know, all they had to do was, you know, make believe, you know, get into some fairy tale here. Give me some energy on the Queen of Pentacles. Why is the Queen of Pentacles here for Pisces? Okay, that's a lot of cards. That's a lot of cards. So we're going to pull again. Give me another energy on the Queen of Pentacles. Okay. I have the Ten of Swords. Everything is fine. So um, somebody is like defeated or feels defeated here. Give me another um, energy on um, for Pisces. I'm even hearing debilitating. Somebody could um, be sick, have some type of um, debilitating disease here. I think, what did, what did I get that for? Um... I just said Aquarius. I think Capricorn. I got that for Capricorn. Give me another energy. Oh, the world in the reverse. Yeah, for some of you, somebody definitely lost a pregnancy here. We have... Um, and I know I'm picking up the energy heavy, but it's just, it's heavy. That's what spirit is giving me. But again, my condolences, because I definitely know what that feels like. 
Um, we have Leo, Aquarius, Scorpio, and Taurus. Heavy on the Taurus. This Queen of Pentacles. Give me another energy on the Ten of Swords. Why is the Ten of Swords here? The Five of Pentacles. So listen, somebody is like struggling, okay? With this Five of Pentacles in the reverse, it's like a continuous struggle. Like, um, this person is losing a lot. I feel like somebody like really wanted to trade lives with you here. So they wanted you to be in a continuous struggle. But it's like whatever this person did, it didn't work. So now it's like they feel defeated because whatever they wanted for you, like, you know, they're getting this. They're stuck in an endless cycle here of lack, of just loss. Um, I heard oppression. Somebody could feel oppressed at this time. Give me another energy for the 10 of swords four four of wands in the reverse yeah um whoever this person like was in a relationship with connection married to that's no longer somebody could have also lost a home as well and a job i'm hearing yeah but it's like this person is just losing things constantly they're just losing losing things like with this everything is fine like this person's trying to like keep their head above water they're trying to kind of like suppress their emotions and um not really focus on what's happening around them but it's kind of hard because they're going through a lot of losses right now they're taking a lot of hits in life give me another energy for the world why is the world in the reverse for pisces why is the world in the reverse for pisces The top, I can't even, this person is going through endless towers, Scorpio energy, endless, endless towers, endless just endings, major changes. This person is going through a lot of major changes in their life, like, um, and it'll definitely take this person a long time to recover. I heard recovery unit, yeah, for some of you, this person could have even like been hospital, hospitalized here. Yeah, but somebody's going through, I heard, like, tragic endings. Yeah, somebody's going through a lot right now. Somebody has to deal with a lot of loss and destruction. So let's get some energy on signs and symbolisms. Why are signs and symbolisms here for Pisces? Why are signs and symbolisms here for Pisces? I have the Ace of Pentacles list and somebody's about to get a brand new beginning here, a brand new opportunity. And like this Ace of Pentacles, this is a gift from God. Okay, Pisces, this is a gift from the divine. Pay attention. You're seeing a lot of number sinks. That means something's coming in that's about to change your life. And I heard all at once. For some of you, like these changes are going to happen like all at once, one after another. But it's going to be blessings on top of blessings on top of blessings here. Yeah, for some of you, I heard a while. You've been seeing like a lot of these number synchronicities for a while. I heard months. I heard months on end. Yeah, that means something major, like life changing, like things are never going to go back the way it is. Give me another energy for signs and symbolisms. Why signs and symbolisms here? Why signs and symbolisms here? Signs and symbolisms. Ooh, okay. Oh, I have three. I'll take it. So I have the Four of Cups, the Five of Pentacles, and the Eight of Cups. I feel like for some of you, um, you're leaving someone behind here. Because I'm just looking at this man. I feel like whoever this man is who's in this Five of Pentacles energy of lack, you're leaving this person behind. Yeah, somebody is like it's kind of like you're rejecting this energy. Um Oh wow, for some of you I'm looking at the way this man look on the four of cups and the five of pentacles. For some of you like this person rejected you. Yeah, like they were looking at like other options here, but if you look at this this boy here, like this is what this person looked like when they rejected you and this is what they look like after. Like this person's life has completely like took a major turn, like I heard a downgrade here. And it's like you're moving on. Like you're on a, like I'm just getting like a peaceful path. You're on your journey. You're being divinely led here. 
to walk away. You're going towards like your emotional fulfillment here, your happiness, Pisces. So let's pull some more energy on the cards. Give me some messages for this Ace of Pentacles. Why is this Ace of Pentacles here for Pisces? Why is the Ace of Pentacles here for Pisces, please? The Eight of Pentacles. Listen, whatever it is that you do for work, whatever you've been giving to, time, money, energy, your investments, they're about to pay off. You're about to get a huge payout. Like money is coming in. And with this Ace of Pentacles, I'm getting unexpected. Like all of these changes are happening unexpectedly. Like it's like you're just going to get up one day and it's like, boom, your life is forever changed here, Pisces. Give me an energy for the Four of Cups. Why is the Four of Cups here for Pisces? Why is the Four of Cups here for Pisces? The Four of Cups, please. Ooh. The Knight of Swords. So for some of you, somebody like who rejected you here, like they want to come rushing in. Yes. Um, but I feel like you're not focused on this person because the way like this Eight of Pentacles is positioned with this Knight of Swords, you just have your head down working. I feel like right now you're just focused on your money, on your career success, but it's like somebody kind of want to charge at you here. Somebody could feel rejected by you, like you really don't have no time for this person. For some of you, you're not her phone call, so you're not even answering the phone for this energy, and now they want to be on the attack. But I just feel like you've changed what it is that you value here, like what you put your time into you're putting your time like into yourself and things that you really um care about like things that are really going to pay off for you give me another energy on this four of cups why is this four of cups here for pisces why is the four of cups here Ooh. So I have the Magician in the reverse, Virgo, Gemini energy. So yeah, this person um, was not able like to manifest an opportunity with you. And it's like now they want to come rushing in or you weren't able to manifest opportunity with this person. Either way, it didn't work out. Somebody ended up being rejected. You know, this partnership did not come together. Now somebody wants to come rushing back in here, Pisces. But it's like you're focused on other things. Give me another energy on the Five of Pentacles. Why is the Five of Pentacles here? Because again, signs and symbolisms. Like your life is about to change here. The Seven of Wands. So somebody's like trying to stop all of these um, shifts when it comes to their stability here. Yeah, it's kind of like somebody's trying to fight against the wave. Somebody's trying to like maintain here, hold on to everything they have. And they feel like something's just a struggle. Like this person's going through a lot of obstacles here. Give me another energy for this five of pentacles. But it's this five of pentacles for Pisces. The Five of Pentacles for Pisces, please. The Page of Cups. Yeah, not somebody like want to come in like with a little offer here. Page of Cups offer. Like they not offering you much. Pisces, this could be you. But somebody like, look at this little fish. Somebody's not serious. You know, that's what this is. They're not serious. Or they were not serious. Give me, um, I heard something about an envelope. I don't know. Somebody may be thinking about like writing you a letter here or a promissory note. Somebody could be losing their car, their vehicle. Give me another energy on this Eight of Cups, please. What is this Eight of Cups? Somebody could want you to co-sign for them. Spirit says don't do it. That's a side note. No co-signing, please. Give me an energy on this Eight of Cups for Pisces. Why is this Eight of Cups here? Ooh, the King of Cups in the reverse. Yeah, for some of you with this King of Cups in the reverse, this person was like emotionally manipulative, ice cold to you. This person could have been very mean. For some of you, this person like could have downgraded you, just um, just kind of like treated you any type of way because somebody is like emotionally unavailable. And it's like you had to walk away from that. You had to go find your peace here. Give me another energy. Or this could be you, Pisces, in this energy. This is the King of Cups. Or you could be dealing with another water sign or somebody that has it highly aspected. Give me another energy on this Eight of Cups. Why is this Eight of Cups here? 
for Pisces. Why is the Eight of Cups here for Pisces? Ooh, the Four of Swords. Okay, so I'm getting two messages with this. Um, first, I'm hearing like when I reminisce over you, my darling. Do -do 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 -do. So I feel like somebody um now is thinking about you. You're heavily on this person's mind. Um, somebody can't stop thinking about you. Somebody could be hiding this truth from other people um, or somebody that they're dealing with here. This person could be in a relationship. For some of you, I'm also getting like this is a father as well. Your father could have been this way towards you, could have been very mean and ice cold. And it's like now this person's in deep regret because also what I'm getting is somebody's sick now. Yeah, somebody's health is declining. So it's like now somebody's thinking about what they've done in the past here, Pisces. So yeah, it's kind of like you're walking away from the drama, walking away from anything that no longer benefits you. It's like you have this blessing, this new opportunity coming in. And it's like, while anybody else who like, you know, didn't give you what you deserve, rejected you, was ice cold to you, treated you any type of way, you know, they're going through some major changes. So it's like they're also experiencing signs and symbolisms, but their signs and symbolisms is pertaining to the decline of their life, their stability here. While your signs and symbolisms is pertaining to blessings, new opportunities. So Pisces, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true. Okay, let me get something on the Eight of Pentacles. Spirit says the Eight of Pentacles. Let me get something on the Eight of Pentacles before the Hermit. Virgo energy. You could have Virgo, Virgo highly aspected, but it's like you're just, you have your head down and you're just working. You're very wise here. You definitely went through like some type of transformation and growth, Pisces. You're very enlightened. Um, I feel like you're going to be getting a lot of downloads and messages from Spirit about some type of new project um, that you need to start that's going to give you a lot of money. I heard residual income, so definitely pay a attention, I heard, to your dreams because um, Spirit is going to be communicating a lot to you in your dream state. And also, um, keep whatever it is that you're doing secret. Don't tell anyone about what it is that you're creating or trying to manifest. So Pisces, these are your messages. I hope they resonate. Stay true to thyself and real with thyself. Grow with me as I grow with you. Stay blessed.